Hi, welcome to Bearded Meeple. I love flowers, but this guy, green thumbs, yeah, not so much. Today, we are going to take a look at a great filler game that'll give you the experience of running your own floral business. It's for one to four players, ages 10 plus, and it plays in about 20 minutes. It's brought to us by Dr. Finn's Games. It's the Little Flower Shop. Let's take a look at it. Each player board is a shop window and you'll begin with three empty vases. Each player also has a register card. We'll explain the different aspects on the player board in a moment. We have cards for money, as well as salary cards. You can fill orders for income and use money to purchase hanging baskets. Each shop window has three locations for hanging baskets. The flowers, come in four different types, sometimes with filler, as doubles, or a triple. Each vase needs a particular type of flower or flowers to be filled. Sometimes they can be wild, and if filled, they'll be worth points at the end of the game based on the fallen petals. Let's take a look at the player boards, the setup, and the gameplay. Your shop window can hold up to eight vases and three hanging baskets. It's a drafting game. From your seven card hand, you will select a card and place it face down. On round one and three, you will pass cards to the left. On round two, you will pass to the right. In storage, you can hold a max of four cards at any given time. Also, at any time on your turn, you could purchase a hanging basket if it's in storage, placing the basket in your window, paying the money from your register to the bank. You now have additional space in your storage. You can also fill an order. The card will be discarded. You may purchase flowers and or a vase for money that will go in your register. Those cards will be removed from the game and discarded. Discarded cards are different than placing cards in your trash. During gameplay, if you want to get rid of something to make room for something else, you can trash cards. But be careful, every two cards in your trash are worth negative one point. Each player has their player board and their three starting vases, as well as their register card. We have the money set, shuffle the deck, and deal each player seven cards. We're ready to begin. From your hand, you'll select a card and place it face down. The remainder of your deck, you will place in the upper left corner on round one and three to pass to the left, round two to pass to the right. Players will simultaneously reveal and take the appropriate action based on the card they've selected. As we have one flower that can go in this vase, we will place it there and the game progresses. You take your next hand, everyone simultaneously selects, reveals, and gameplay continues. As gameplay progresses and you receive your final card for the round, you may spend $2 to discard the card and draw the top card from the deck and use it accordingly. And trust me, three rounds back and forth will go by very fast. As there are limited cards, you do have to plan carefully because at game end, any cards in storage will go to your trash for negative points. Any empty vases in your window will go to your trash for negative points. You'll receive one point for every $5 in your register. Hanging baskets will have a point value and you'll receive points based on properly filled vases for the fallen petals at the bottom of each. The player with the most points will win. And that, my friends, is the Little Flower Shop. This game is fantastic. It's well designed and well put together as a game. A couple of things I'd like to say. I like the art style, but I especially like the use of the player board as your shop window, setting up your display and using all the different aspects of it. 
Now the gameplay blew me away. I love card drafting, but this game plays so fast, you're only going to have so many cards each round, you really have to plan carefully with your vases, with your hanging baskets, what you're going to sell for money, because before you know it, the game's done. You're like, oh, I thought there was one more turn, or I needed this type of plan. You have to plan and strategize. It's quick, fun. I really enjoyed it. I hope you get a chance to check it out. I'll talk to you again soon.